So here's what I'm planning on doing. If everything goes how I want it to, I want to finish up Woman Woman's thing thing. Which I think I can do if I do it like this. If I do this guy today, and then her, and then her twice? Maybe that'll work? I'm not sure. Last time it really didn't. But anyway, I want to definitely start off with, uh, with this young man. Especially because he's right here. And I said I would. Click. What's wrong? He's got something to say to me. Should I hang out with Ryoma? Hell fucking yeah. <laughs> you come to lecture me about not having the will to live? <laughs> oh god. I'll sit and listen if it makes you feel better. Oh, what a cool guy. For not wanting to live and all. I spent some time talking with Ryoma. Ryoma and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give a... Hell yeah. Now this is when I give him a... Um... Pop amongst kids who want to imitate adults. Is that? That work with Ryan? <laughs> Not bad at all. Yeah, he's got his little cigarette in there. Even I want to feel happy, so I'll accept this. Thanks. Hey. Well, why did you come to talk to me? You probably just want to hear how I took down that mafia, right? Huh? That's not what I was planning at all. Lord. You've got a nosy looking face. Are you worried about whether or not I still care about tennis? For some reason, that's another thing busybodies seem to care about. No. I wasn't trying to, uh... I just wanted to talk to you. Oh. Is that so? You've still got a ways to go. I was the only one who was worried. <laughs> I still got a ways to go. Yeah. To be honest, I can't say that I have no interest in your ultimate <laughs> talent. That is honest. Aren't you a detective? Such honesty might be seen as foolish, you know. <laughs> I suppose that's true, yeah. But out of respect for that honesty, I don't mind talking about tennis for a bit. Huh? Yeah. That's what I said, didn't you hear me? <laughs> what should I talk about specifically? Ryoma looked downward in contemplation, yet his expression remained happy. It seemed as though Ryoma hadn't lost his passion for tennis. He put on an act like it's not a big deal, but clearly, he must be really struggling. Then. How about you tell me a little about your friends from the tennis club? Mm -hmm. My friends from tennis club? Then... The ones who stick out the most is that one guy. Mm -hmm. Who? Yeah. Our team captain. I do regret that I was never able to break his zone. Uh, um, his zone? In other words... A skill where he can stay in a single spot and continuously return the ball. Huh? You can do that? <laughs> Not me. Our captain was the only one who could do that. I was called an ultimate, but compared to them, I've still got a ways to go. <laughs> Fucking hell. There was also an upperclassman in the club who got considered a genius. He developed counter moves that only he could possibly pull off. He was always smiling, but you could never quite tell what he was thinking. Oh. Speaking of that, there was another upperclassman. He made us drink these weird drinks. They were so nasty, I thought I was gonna die. Huh? That bad, huh? Yeah. He said they were made of vegetable juice, but anyone could tell they weren't normal. Hmm. So your school has some unique players. <laughs> yeah. It was certainly, it certainly wasn't boring. It's a place I've got nothing to do with uh, anymore. Um, Ryoma? Sorry. I was talking too much. You probably got bored listening. Sorry, I wasted your time. See ya. That's uh, a little bit sad. Okay. Oh. All right. My bad about earlier when I said you had a nosy looking no. face. That's all right, Ryoma. It doesn't bother me a bit. See ya. Look at that face. See ya. Beautiful. Hell yeah, dude. I love it. I watched Ryan walk away as I returned to my room. That was nice. Ryan was cool. I definitely want to complete his thing, assuming he doesn't get fucking murdered or die. All right. Wait, get murdered or die. I mean, be a murderer or die. Oops. Still some time left. Right. It means I get to go to this door. And I gotta hit him. I get to hit my F1 key, and she's in her dorms. Perfect. 
Hell yeah, dude. Uh, weird child. Click. I'm not feeling so good. <laughs> I think that flashback like was a blad a blad influence on my magic. <laughs> Should I hang out with Himiko? Wait, let me say no. See ya! <laughs> Made you come out of your room for nothing. <laughs> That's kind of a dick move. I need to go to the fucking the place to get my rewards because I'm pretty sure when I beat that chapter I had to have got at least one coin. There's no way I did not get it one coin. Alright, the skook stook. Giraffe! Ow, I almost just broke my neck. That was, uh, that was pretty nice. 397 coins! I'm gonna be here for years, dude. I think I'm stopping at 250. Whew. I now I have an adequate thing to give woman woman. <laughs> Hell yeah. Right. Perfect timing. I'll see fun off some of your life force to replenish my magic. Don't worry, I won't kill you. I'm not a dark mage after all. I spent some time with Himiko. Himiko and I grew a little closer today. Should I like to give Himiko a present? Defiantly. Alright. Oh, wait, no. I'm gonna go... I don't want to give her the same gifts, though. So I'm gonna give her something a little bit different. It would be a waste to give them these. Can't increase... I can't... The increased quality. Ah. You clearly know what's important for a mage. Bird seed. What? <laughs> I'll show you some of my magic. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey. Himiko? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um. Himiko. What? But <laughs> she looks annoyed. Her glare is telling me to go uh, away. Um. You don't want to talk to me. You could have turned me down. What a pain. I'm too lazy to say no. Isn't it more work just to say yes, though? Hmm. Let's see. I've never met someone so thoroughly lazy. But this is strange. Oh. Miko, why did you decide to be a magician? Okay. I'm not a magician. I'm a mage. And I use real magic, don't get it wrong. It's magic. It's real magic, okay? You get it, right? Real magic, sure. Then show me some real magic. Then? Right now. Well, that's... There's no mana here, so I can't. If you sacrificed yourself, I could. No. I'd rather not be sacrificed, so I'll decline. Mm -hmm. That's too bad. I guess you're just not passionate enough about magic. Not passionate enough to sacrifice myself, maybe. Mm -hmm. What are we talking about? Why I'm a mage? Why are you asking about That's... that? Well, because... Isn't it strange that such a lazy girl would go through so much work for a magic trick? <laughs> Remember. Seems like magic requires a ton of work to prepare, so... Jeez. A typical amateur question. You don't need annoying preparations for magic. <laughs> I see. I'm, a mage. I'm talented. Not relying on my talent would go against my master's teachings. Mm. You have a master? Yeah. Did I not tell okay. you? It's the first time I'm hearing it. So there, there are apprentice ma magicians? Mm. That's right. My master was an amazing archmage. Wait. Hey, wait. You called me a magician again. I'm a mage. Wait, it reset? What? Huh. It reset my fragments. Because I'm playing as him? Hmm. This is an official announcement. Ultimate Academy is now 10 p.m. For now. Everyone is out now on work duty. Bedtime or sign. Bedtime or sign. Uh, it's getting a little bit scary. I don't like Monodam right now. I really flew by, too. As I lay in bed, Ryoma's words came back to me. Mm. Reason to live. When I really think about it, what do I have? I want to see my family and friends again, but is that a reason to live? But... Yeah, yeah, I'd say. I wonder how it was for Kaede. I'm sure she had pleasant, plenty of reasons to live. This is the kind of girl she was. But I... Why am I thinking about this? I shouldn't be thinking this stuff. I need to stop thinking that way, but when I'm alone, I can't help it. Damn it! Damn it! I've been defeated. 
With all of my willpower, I forced myself to sleep. Uh-oh. Um. Is he sleeping? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's sleeping. He's out like a light. Oh. Like a like? You mean out like a light? More importantly. Who cares? Just hurry up and leave the present so we can get out of here. Mm. Don't rush me, jeez, it's dark in here. I can't tell which is which. Oh shit, he's gonna give me the wrong quote unquote gift. Whatever this gift is. Oh my god! College entrance exams are a big milestone on par for finding a job or getting married. Why are you being pecked? Why are you having blood come out? You're literally a fucking like mechanical bear. Are you examinees out out there working hard when studying? Focus on what's most important. Boost your focus by throwing away all those comic books and video games. Oh, but Spike Chunsoft games are fine. They're specifically made to improve your focus. And burn those pictures like your girlfriend. You don't have time to indulge in good memories. But make sure you don't burn your actual girlfriend, because you'll go to prison for that. Prison might help you focus, but then you won't be able to go to your exams. If you can't focus at all, it's also good to confine yourself somewhere and study. I recommend confining yourself in an enemy base. The thrill of studying in a place where you might get caught does wonders for your focus. Oh, and I also recommend studying in a disaster zone. The thrill of studying in a place where you could actually die does wonders for your focus. Oh, and I also recommend studying in the middle of your exams. The thrill of knowing that you're too late to get any studying then does wonders for your focus. With that advice, you'll beat the competition, so get out there and do your best. <laughs> it's so dumb. It does wonders. <laughs> <sighs> Dum, bing, bum. Hey, it's a present. We're all back. This is an official announcement. From the Ultimate Academy, it is now Adam. So Have a wonderful killing school semester today. Mm. Wonderful announcement, Mondo. Damn, I can't believe this is your hey. first time. Is it really your first time, is it? Hey, is this really your first time? The first time. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're blushing, how cute. More importantly, you dropped off some presents in your rooms. Cower and fear, cause hell starts so here. Alright. Take a look at this cool new fucking present I got. Looks like a monopad. Cubs pad. Huh? Cubs pad? And I touched the screen, the device came to life and started playing a video. Oh no. Tied to Momota's motive right. video. Back by popular demand, it's time for the motive video! Oh no. Who's the most important person in your life? And now, without further ado. This isn't good. Kaito. Well, at least I know a little bit about Kaito. Kaito Momota! The ultimate astronaut! Thanks to his exceptional talent, this young man is already an astronaut trainee. Wow. Our team has managed to score an exclusive interview with his grandparents. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. They miss their grandson terribly and hope he returns to them safe and sound. But don't just take my word for it. Let's hear it straight from the source. Kaito, as long as you're alive, I don't need anything else. No matter what happens, you must live. You must never give up. Please, live on. For our sakes, too. Aww. Their only wish is for Kaito to live. Will Kaito be able to fulfill his grandparents' wish? This guy's an asshole. <laughs> ah, yes. One more thing. Shortly after this interview wrapped, these old farts suffered an unfortunate accident. What kind of accident? It's a secret! Find out for yourself! <laughs> oh. Find out huh? for myself. Uh, um... To be another one of Monokuma's motives? Even if it were, why do I have Kaito's motive? No. I'll think about that stuff later. I should hurry and tell Kaito. I ran out of the hallway of Miss to find Kaito. <laughs> Everyone's gonna be rushing to show each other the fucking things. Oh, this sucks. <sighs> Actually, no, while I'm here, I might as well save. I have no reason not to. Oh. 
Though I am kind of bummed that the thing reset. Kaido, are you here? I pressed the doorbell. No answer. Did you already leave? In that case, you must be at the dining hall. I'll try there. Alright. No problem here. Just a little bit of hide and seek. Kibo! Kibo! Have you seen Kai? Shuichi. Impeccable time, Shuichi. I was on my way to get you. Huh? You are? Please. Everyone is gathering in the dining hall. Please come right away. I'll go get everyone else. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, it's definitely about the videos. I should go to the dining hall. Kaido must be there. I don't like this anticipation. Is that a guy? Hello? He's just chilling in the overworld? Oh my god, that's so stupid. I hate this fucking stupid collectathon. It could be anywhere. It's so random. <laughs> Whatever, I need to get to the dining hall and talk to Kaito, quote-unquote. I'm very, very curious to how everyone's dealing with this. There's only a select people here. Um, Anyone seen Kaito? <laughs> Over the Cubs pad, if I'm not mistaken. Uh -huh. Huh? Uh -huh. Not the only one who got one, Shuichi. Uh -oh. We all did. Yeah. We've all been given motive videos, however, they have been mixed up. Huh? Mixed up? Um, when I woke up, there was a cups pad in my room, but the video wasn't even mine. Man. Sumugi, we should discuss this once everyone is here. Huh? Sorry, you're right. Uh, um, what, what do you mean, once everyone is here? Yes. Kaito and Kibo went to gather everyone else, though we may discuss yeah. our plans. I will wait for everyone, then. Until then, I can provide you all with massages. Everyone's here. <laughs> um... um What's what? What the fuck? What is with this predictive ability today? Thank you for waiting. We gathered everyone else. Dear. My word. And after I was about to finally experience one of Kurumi's famed massages. What is it? What do you mean? Are you also struggling that I can't- Wait, are you also suggesting that I cannot read the air? Well... So what is it? Why did you drag us Come here? Come on, man. Didn't I tell you it's about the cub pads? <laughs> Monokuma gave us a new motive. We can't not talk about it. That's so? The thing looks like another monopad. That was a motive? Huh? Haven't you watched the video on the cubs pad? No, I ignored it because I figured it was something stupid. <laughs> That's actually really courageous in a weird sort of way. Hey! You don't have to speak up, but this is important. You should at least listen. So, so what are these videos? Hmm. No doubt they're motives from Monokuma, but why were they all mixed up? Honest. Why ain't gone to get Sumuki's video? Hey! Don't say it! Huh? Huh? I heard it. I see. So Gonta has my video. Gonta not supposed to say it? Who fucking cares? <laughs> We're gonna exchange them anyway. Well. We cannot exchange them. Can't? Why? They're videos of the most important people in our lives. No. And that's precisely why we cannot exchange them. Listen closely. Although we do not know why our motives were mixed up, as long as we don't exchange them, we don't have to see our motives hey. at all. So it's better to just ignore them. Yes. Yes, at least that's what I think. Mm -hmm. That is true. If we ignore them, then they won't have a motive. No. I'm against that. Why? Against that? Why? You see that video, it'll turn into a motive, right? <laughs> That's why I want to see it. Uh, um... You do? Always messing around. Saying something like that before, you don't plan on surviving. It might not matter whether you get killed or not, but no, wait, he's gonna flip this around. If he has a motive, most important people, it'll give him a reason to live. Dumbass! Wake up already. You're like some zombie wandering around with no will to live. <laughs> no will to live, huh? If that's how you've seen me, then s so be it. Not cool. But I got no plans to change my opinion. That's just not cool. What, what did you just mm -hmm. say? Who cares? Ryoma has stated his opinion. Because I feel the same way as him. Kokichi. Are you trying to cause trouble again? <laughs> so mean. Get the wrong idea. I'm not saying we should care about killing or dying. <laughs> but I think it's better if we didn't cooperate with each other. <laughs> Actually, we definitely shouldn't cooperate with each other. Why? That's awful. <laughs> because? I think it's back... I think... Oh my god. Think back to all Monokuma's actions so far. Whether we tried to work together, Monokuma would retaliate with a plan to make us suffer. It happened when Kaede wanted to cooperate and again with these motive videos, right? <laughs> Which means more, the more we try to cooperate, the more he'll try to make us suffer. So giving up is your fucking plan A? Then... 
saying that if we do not rally together, he will not be made to suffer? We will not be made to suffer. Well, I cannot read today. That's why I had no choice but to screw with you guys. But you ingrates didn't even notice. That's... And you're not lying to us right now. Well, you know... Whether I'm lying or not, what I'm saying is still true. You know... We should... We shouldn't force ourselves to, to cooperate. Let's all just do our own thing. So I agree with Wyoma. Wyoma. Oh my god, kill me. It's because we're trying to cooperate that Monokuma is making us suffer. What about everything we went through? What's the point of Kaede sacrificing herself? So that means... I'm warning... I'm warning you all for your sake. Let's just exchange our motive videos instead of cooperating with each other. Incomprehensible. I cannot comprehend that logic. See? Well, now I've said I won't cooperate. I can't afford to be seen with you, losers. Come on, Gonta, let's go. Huh? Gonta, too? Because... Promise to think of a way to get everyone to exchange their motive videos, remember? So that means... Harumi, I'll hit you up later when I'm feeling hungry. Huh? Did Gonta make promise? Actually... Why can't... Why can't you tell when he's lying, Gonta? <sighs> Quit screwing around. Our sake? Yeah, right. I've had it with his lies. No. So what are we doing? Are we all done here? Then I'm leaving. <sighs> Bring me my dinner later. Poor right. Karumi. <laughs> I'm heading out too. Right. Wait, Ryoma. Don't forget, we're all struggling to get out of here alive. So don't get in our way. Jeez. Got no intention of getting in your way. I'd never do something so uncool. By the way. Karumi, can I get you to clean my room later? Actually. You guys are relying on Karumi way too much. I was gonna say that. I do not agree. I do not mind. Serving others is the true desire of any maid. Huh. You shouldn't spoil people, though, especially degenerate males. In any event. Our cooperation is the number one factor in our suffering, is it? How I wonder this will turn out. I will observe with great interest. I shall observe. Oh, and Karumi, I shall have you record my observations. I trust you to do it properly. Karumi's doing everything out here. <laughs> Well, I'm certainly not gonna hang out with a bunch of chumps like you. That being said. Guess I'll be back. Take a shit and get some sleep. Karumi, think of an invention for me, okay? Why is everyone saying this to Karumi? How much is everyone gonna depend on Karumi? My workload has increased significantly. This calls for a more tactical approach. Come on, you can't spoil them. They'll just turn into ungrateful leeches. Oh no. Wait, what's wrong, Himiko? Are you hungry? Right. How about we eat together, Karumi? One tripe hot pot, please. Um, Enko, you're giving into you're giving her more work. Why is she so sad? Himiko? You don't like tripe hot pot? Uh... You get it. Tenko, Himiko isn't hungry. You don't get it. Oh my god. What's going on? I know, because I have the almighty Atua. <laughs> Whatever. Let's just enjoy some tripe hot pot. Jeez. You're so careless. <laughs> what the fuck's going on? In the end, those of us who stayed behind had tripe hot pot for a quirky, for a quirky take on breakfast. We also promised not to show each other our motives. Oh my god. I love it when our fucking group of survivors are split down the middle. How oh, great. Hmm. So here's the good news, right? Well, I have to plug in my microphone to charge. Yeah, <sighs> okay. So... I think that it's good that we decided not to share the motos when we have Kaito. That's good. So Kaito won't have... We won't ever be shared. Who wants to do their own thing? Why can't we work together as a group? I wish we could do something on my own, but that's impossible. If I screw up, it'll be over like Kaede it's all no over use. again. But again, I can't keep these thoughts out of my head. I can't stand around doing nothing. I promised her. And now I'm going to go and if I can do a thing or two. Cubs pad. Or something to tell each other who has whose motive. Except Gonda went out and said his immediately. Rumi's here. So here's what I'm thinking. Uh, I'm gonna go with fucking Small Man McBoy. I think. That's who I'm gonna get first with fucking Shuichi. Hi, dude. Yeah. Since the motives are swapped, as long as we don't sort them out, no murders will happen. Or so Kibo said, but somebody might take action because they want to see the motive. Somebody? Even you? Maybe I should stop him. Why does it say yes or no? 
Don't get it wrong. I haven't fallen so low that I do something like that. Even if a murderer said something like that, no one would believe it. I guess it was me hanging out with him, right? I spent some time with Ryoma. That was a little bit weirdly said. <laughs> Ryoma and I grew a little bit closer today. Would you like to give Ryoma a present? Hell to the mo fucking yeah. I'm gonna give him some fucking sigil roots again. Not bad at all. What's wrong? Uh, what's up? I don't think there's anything for us to talk about. No? Well, now that Ryoma hasn't lost his passion for tennis, after listening to the way he talks about his old tennis friends, I'm sure of it. Maybe I can help Ryoma accept his feelings. What's the matter? Hey! I was just thinking about how fun your tennis stories are. I'd like to hear more. What now? I actually enjoyed those? What a strange guy. We talked about my tennis friends. What else you want to hear? Then... Uh, you have stories about your rivals? <laughs> my rivals? I don't know if I'd call them that, but they were some people. You remember the captain I talked about last time? If I remember correctly... The guy who used the zone technique? Blood. There was a guy who beat him. Huh? His zone was broken? Yeah. Yeah. He used a technique called insight to see his opponent's weaknesses. He made full use of this technique to beat his opponents down. He was feared as the king of the courts. King? However... There were others with crazy nicknames like Child of God and Emperor. Uh, um, Child of God, Emperor. There are tennis players like that? Yeah. Yeah, the Child of God's aura was a real pain. All five of my senses were stolen, and in the end, I couldn't even stand. Uh -huh. What the fuck? Yeah. Emperor's special technique was called Fu Rin Ka Ya, or Zan. I faced it once, but then he unsealed the true power, and it became Fu Rin Ka in Zan Rai. You need all those secret techniques for tennis. <laughs> we'd all give everything we'd have, but being defeated only made us stronger. That was the type of world I lived in. It's beyond the realm of tennis. Must have been lots of fun. Beyond the realm. Those are all so like those are good responses. They say it must have been a lot of fun. That's true. Why? Why do you think that? That's... Because you all look like you were having a lot of fun telling that story. You're right. I can't say it was boring. That's an old story. Well, that's enough. If I talk anymore, I'll start to remember the things oh. best forgotten. What am I saying? It's not like me to get so emotional. See ya. See ya. Oh, why am I so sad? <laughs> oh well, I've enhanced my fucking friendship. It's good enough for me. I watched Ryoma walk away, dejected, and I returned to my room. Still some time left. Can't sit around doing nothing. I mean, I can. That is legitimately an option I have. I hate it because I'm nearing up on the other murder now. Like, I swear I can just feel it. Because the motives are going to get fucking thrown all over the goddamn place. I want to get sad. <laughs> okay. There's uh, those guys hanging out discussing how to fucking swap the motives. So that's pretty cool that I can see that in free time. Oh, damn. Um, I'm trying to go down the stairs now. That's a negative on the amount of people that I'm looking for right in that exact location. Why the fuck am I so lost? It's because there's another floor. Oh my god. <laughs> He's in his ultimate room. No, he is not. He's over here with other chick. Hey, dude. Oh, did you know there's a fucking third floor to this uh... building? I'm not planning to stop you guys. This is cooperation, like Kokichi is, so I won't get in your way. Should I hang out with Ryoma? Hell to the mo fucking yeah. yep. Fine, do what you want. <laughs> I'm getting in your way, pal. Spend some time with Ryoma. Ryoma and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Ryoma a present? Absolutely. 
bedding created by hanging a net between two poles or trees lounging in one of these is someone everything dreamed of at least once. Try it. Not bad at all. Sometimes even I want to feel happy. I'll accept this thing. It doesn't really matter what you give. It's always the same response. <laughs> I'm not going to talk about tennis anymore. What happened? Jeez. I know what you're up to. You just want me to play tennis again. Ah. <laughs> I thought so. Hey. Listen up, I'm no longer the ultimate tennis pro. I'm just the shell of who I used to be. I threw away my what? past. Did you really, Ryoma? Huh? Hey. I don't think it's so easy to throw away the burdens we carry. It's hard to see what you're carrying on your own back. Even if you wanted to throw it all away, I'm sure some is still there. Clinging to you. Something you can't quite get rid of. Like a coffee stain on your shirt. <laughs> a coffee stain? What kind of explanation is that? No. Ah, well, my uncle used to say that all the time. He taught me that detectives should always look for the stain on people. That's how you find the truth. That's how my uncle did it anyway. <laughs> That's something you got from your uncle. Well, I guess it works after all. I bet your uncle's a good detective. I knew it. There's something you're still carrying. Is it ten- No. No, it's not tennis. <laughs> it's something that should never happen in tennis. But I gathered my resolve and did it. That's- What do you mean by that? More importantly- Nothing. We were talking about coffee stains on the back, though, right? Oh, mouse? Sorry, but I got nothing back oh, there. There's one regret I'm carrying around. It had to be her. Huh? Who? Yeah. There was a person I promised my future to. Huh? You mean, like a lover? <laughs> Did that surprising I had a lover? I'm used to that reaction. Uh, um... You said had. Past tense? Yeah. Yeah. I met her in America when I was studying tennis abroad. At the time, I didn't believe in love. I thought it was a joke. Honestly, I don't know how we fell in love, but she's not part of this world anymore. No. So she... Yeah. Yeah. She died. Why? How did she die? <laughs> I decided to throw everything away. It didn't matter if we loved each other. Uh, um... But she was so important to you that you wanted a future together, so why... Don't you get it? She would have been unhappy being with me. Not just her. Anyone. What? That's why you should you shouldn't bother with me anymore. Uh, Got it? Um Ryoma? See ya. In his weird fighting stance. See ya. Alright, dude. I mean I'm not gonna follow your instructions. But wow, he had a lover and she died. And then he threw everything away. That's uh Wow, holy shit, Ryoma. That's a pretty fucked up past, considering you're also in jail. So. <sighs> I'm probably not currently in jail, but he's he's jailed. He's murdered people. This guy's fuck. He's all sorts of fucking complications.